Hey, what's up everyone? Welcome back to another video. And you know, I've been there's something that you know that happened the other day that I wanted I wanted to tell you guys about because I kind of had something to do with texture and and stuff, you know, how I you know how I am with certain textures kind of thing. So, you know, that's what I want to talk about. And so, the other day, what we did is we made burgers and you know homemade burgers and i like burgers but you know i get them a lot when i go to restaurants and stuff I, i'll get like burgers and you know i don't for some reason i didn't like burgers at home as much and you know it took me a while to figure out kind of what the problem was about why i didn't like the homemade burgers so much but i'll eat restaurant burgers well Here's where kind of the texture part comes in. It's that the homemade burgers, you know how the burgers, you know, you get like at restaurants or burgers, like you like have juices and they're like really juicy burgers, you know, kind of thing. You know, I like juicy burgers and a lot of the, a lot of the times when I get them at restaurants, they're nice and juicy. However, the homemade hamburgers, you know, what we do is we grill them. And I think what happened was, is we were using more like lean meat, I suppose. And, you know, the when they grilled, you know, if they got like, we were grilled too much or something, or I don't know about over grilled, but when the, but they were grilled enough to the point where they were dried out, you know, and they were dry. And I don't really like dry burgers. I mean, I still love burgers, but those burgers were a bit too dry for me. And, you know, it kind of, I didn't like the texture of the dry burgers because it just, you know, it's just kind of a not as very pleasant texture, you know, when I'm chewing and eating a dry burger versus a juicy burger kind of thing. So I told my dad about this the other day, about how that was the problem with the burgers being dry and, you know, how I didn't really like the dryness of the burger because it was a kind of a texture problem. And I told him that I like more juicy burgers. I don't have really a problem with juicy burgers. You know, yeah, I, li I like juicy burgers, you know, a lot more because I think, you know, it's not... Because the texture's better with, with juicy burgers. It, it has a much, much better texture when they're nice and juicy versus when they're dry. So, yeah, that's why, you know, I didn't like dry burgers because the texture's just kind of was awful to me. So we made the burgers juicier the other day when we had them. And I think that they felt, the texture felt a lot better. And, you know, they tasted better too. You know, that's why I can usually eat juicy burgers, but not really dry burgers, you know. And plus, you know, juicy burgers, I guess, just taste better. Dry burgers don't really have much, you know, the juiciness gives it more flavor and the dryness doesn't have that much flavor, but it's not about the flavor here. It's more about the texture. Like, I think it had both a better flavor and texture when it was more juicy and it was something that I was able to enjoy, enjoy more than a burger that's been dried out because then that creates kind of a not so pleasant texture and you know it doesn't have as much flavor Same thing with like taco meat like if i like taco meat that's like juicier i guess and like that yeah juicier taco meat and not because sometimes what happens is is so a lot of the time when we make taco meat you know the taco meat would be dry because drier because my mom liked it that way so back when she was here you know she would she would like it she would like her taco meat more dry however since she's in georgia away away in georgia for studying chiropractic um you know since you know she's not here at the moment you know 
we decided, you know, that we're going to make our taco meat more juicier because, you know, she's, you know, because she isn't here and she won't have to worry about it. Because, like I said, she likes her taco meat more dry. But, you know, when she comes home, I'm sure we can make, I'm sure we can make the taco meat more dry probably for her. And we'll have to eat it probably more dry then. But for now, we're going to make it pretty juicy. So, I don't really like dry taco meat either. Because it just doesn't, like I said, the texture is weird and it just doesn't taste as good. I just don't really like the texture of dry meat, try, dry ground meat. I like it more juicy, you know, and flavorful because, you know, it creates a much better texture that way. So that's something that I, it took me a while to realize why I didn't like, you know, homemade burgers as much as, you know, other burgers. And that's because I had pointed out to my dad that they had been, too dry and that's what you know kind of caused the texture problem is then being too dry and not enough juice you know kind of thing and and now I've now that I've told him that he agreed and wanted to make the burgers more juicier for even himself because I guess he prefers more juicier burgers than dry burgers too and you know we both kind of agreed on that and then we made our burgers the other day juicier and I think they had a much better texture than dry burgers I think it was you know much more enjoyable to eat without having to worry about you know the dry textures and all that for those on the spectrum watching this um, comment down below if you don't like the texture of dry ground meat either and that's gonna be it for today everybody thanks for watching if you enjoyed this, make sure to like, subscribe, comment, and a share would greatly be appreciated. Always happy when people share my videos. So a share would definitely be appreciated. So please, please, please share. And with that said, I will see you guys next time. Bye.